up guys and girls, I am Virtual Peaks and welcome back to Planet Nomads. It has been a long, long, long time since I started doing this. Well, since I last done this rather. And um, it looks like we're going to have to do a new save at some point because um, this one apparently doesn't really work anymore. But it's fine because um, we have just a few things left to do on this really and then that will be us pretty much done. Good lord that rain! <laughs> no thank you, can, can we do without the rain please? Right, so. Um, I mean, aside from dealing with the rain, which uh, at this rate. Also, what is going on? I get the feeling that my um, power grid is not quite working the way it's meant to. Right, I should stop the rain. Is that stop the rain? Is it still raining? No, but it's still noisy as balls out here. Right. I... No, okay, yeah, you are working. You're just super fucking noisy for some reason. Hmm. Yes, okay. I probably need to fix that at some point. But in the meantime... Uh, what the bloody hell is all this for? I don't even remember. That is powering something, but I don't actually know what. So, um, god damn it! All I want to do is get on my little platform. There we go. Right, so let's go in here. What, what the flipping hell are you powering? You are powering that? No, that doesn't look right. What in good God's name are you powering? I actually legitimately have no idea. I mean, this has got to be powering something, surely, so... What, exactly? Okay. The only thing I can think is that it's powering the lights? Maybe? It must be. It must be the lights. It must be powering the lights. But it's fine. Because if it's powering the lights, that is all fine and dandy. I don't remember what that generator is for. That one has a uh, ridiculous amount of time left in it. Uh, then we've got the generator up in front here. Which still has about the same. I need to stick fan blades on this. I need to make this thing so that it's able to actually fly. More importantly, it needs to be able to keep up with this thing. So, I'm thinking... Bear with me on this one. So I don't have anything left in that, so um, what in God's name is that? Okay, they, they've added new things to this and I didn't even bother to check that. Right, well let's go down here where it's a bit quieter and I can work out what exactly they've added to this because what? Okay, so trophy, trophy, replicator of which I have no idea what it does. More trophies, trophies, so decorational stuff. Whatever the bloody hell that thing is. And that's 
it? Yeah, I want to say that's pretty much it. So what do you require? Okay. No. I tell you what, we have a whole heap of stuff down here, so why don't we make one? And oh, itchy nose. Figure out whether my um travelling drill ship requires one or not. Because by the looks of it, it's pretty heavy. Also, why is everything so goddamn fucking loud? Master volume. There we go. Ah, <sighs> much better. Right, so. Now that everything's not operating at like maximum fucking volume. Right, so what the fuck? What? What is this exactly? Wait, what? Polycrystal chassis. Okay, what the fuck is a polycrystal chassis then? I mean, I can make one. Crystal override matrix. What? Special hacking tool matrix combines alien technology with the train uh, with Terran interface. Thanks to uh, that user is able to bypass the fence system of the creators. Okay, so I should probably make one of those at some point. Oh! Oh, okay, so I need those. Right, okay, so it looks like I'm not actually going to be able to make that just yet. Because I need more things that I don't actually have at the moment. Um, what... Actually, oh, okay, you're, you're still printing out freaking oodles of those. Lovely, just what I need. I mean, I don't need them, but, you know, I suppose. I suppose we'll make do with it. Um, so we'll need that. Um, I mean, I'm not... 100% worried whether this thing is particularly pretty or not. I suppose I probably should make it at least a little pretty. So we'll take a couple of those, I guess. And, uh... Yeah, I think we'll work from that. Right. Uh, how heavy is this thing in comparison to that? So it's 46, 5. Okay, so it's. It looks to be. Right, so that's 21,420. And this is 46,550. Okay, so. We are, in fact, actually going to have to put, like, all four of these on. That is actually going to be a requirement. And even then, there is a uh, slight chance that this thing might actually just be too heavy. That's not where I wanted that. Can I have that back, please? Thank you. There we go. go. Right, so I guess we'll just kind of shove them on a bit like, like that. That's uh, not quite how I meant to shove them on, but you know what? I'll make them look pretty in a sec, don't worry, it's fine. Right now I just want to get these things actually on. Oh yeah, of course. So I need uh, so I need five. So I need at least another six. Okie dokie. Mm. Walking into my door again. You, build me six of those, please. Lovely. 
Lovely jubbly. In the meantime. I beg your fucking pardon. You what? You um, excuse me. You wanna run that by me again? What in God's fucking name was that noise? I have no idea, but I don't much like that it was a thing that happened. Don't much appreciate that, so if you could uh, just not do that ever again, that would be much appreciated. And uh, you wanna... Ah, right, see, now I know you're lying to me there, because there we go, now it's updated. Okay, well, I guess while we're waiting for those, we can, um, at the very least, get these done. Again, I will make these look prettier in a sec, just right now, I want them actually on and in place. Come on! There we go. Lovely, right, so... Hopefully, I actually have the materials for all of this. Come on. No. Okay, so I need another 10 composite parts. Of course I do. I'm always running out of something. Always, always, always. Fortunately, this base provides for all. Um, nine. There we go. This base provides all and um, has actually been surprisingly good at supplying all the things that I need. I mean, yes, I know that, you know, this hasn't been the base that I've always had, but, you know, it's, it's a good base. It does what I want. And that is all that counts at the end of the day. So if you could go there, there, there. That is not exactly what I meant to do, but you know. Fine, I guess. Um, and yes, this is all the prettying up that I'm going to do with you, because you know what? It's a big fucking survival box stuck to the back of a ship that looks like an oversized fucking alien insect. So, forgive me if I don't really care what it looks like. Also, you are actually a bit too far back, so I need to take that off. Oops. And, um... Oh, shit. I... Oh, I hope that nothing was up. Seriously? There we go. Alright, I hope there was nothing on that. I don't think there was. Mm. I feel like I should probably go dip inside quickly and just make sure that things didn't break. No, it doesn't look like there was anything attached to that, so that is good, I guess. I would have rather that didn't happen, but it's not a terrible thing that it did, so easy enough to fix. We just um, slap a new one down. Lovely! Right. Now, hopefully, once I get all the uh, correct things selected, I can go around and just 
quickly plaster all of this stuff back together. Thank you. And you too. And then that one. Uh, and that one. Of course I'm short of super ally. I swear, if one day I'll make something and I will be like not short of anything for once. But you know, we'll, I guess we'll just have to wait for that. So what was it? Super alloy. That one. Just remember one of those. Because I only need one. Um I can actually reach these from down here, so eh. Come on, super alloy. Be done already. I know you're going to be done with it. There we go. Lovely. Right, so. Now I just need to plug all of that into the power. Um, which is that one there. question because I know those things have a limited range so right so you are actually plugged into something but why what are you plugged into you're just plugging you're plugging to the red line what's the line that I'm using for this okay so red is the same line I'm using Question mark? Well, you know what? Either way, I still need to put a new uh, controller down. A new switchboard down. There we go. Uh, something a bit like that. Beautiful. Right, so. Once I have gotten this all uh, conjiggered. I need to work out how exactly... This needs to turn. I think because this thing is now long enough, I should actually be able to get away with just having forward direction on that. Yeah, I should be able to get the way of just forward direction because where these are going to be stabilizing, the front end should just pull it in the direction that it needs to be going whenever I make a shifting direction. Now what I need to do is just plug this into the... Um Oh, okay, that's the orange line. Oh, yeah, no, I, I remember what I did with that now. I um, separated it onto a solar power so that no matter what, the refinery would always be able to work. So that, you know, if I ran out of um, uranium or something, which ain't going to happen, frankly, I would actually be able to still refine uranium if I had any on me. Not that that's exactly going to be a problem, mind you, because all I actually have to do is... Uh, okay, no idea what that is, but fine. Uh, just top up the generators. 
Again, I still don't exactly remember what the uh, red one does, but that does something. I just don't know what. Thank you. Much appreciated. Beautiful. So, I guess we will chuck... What, maybe... You are in a well-fed state. Good hydration secured. Yeah, we'll, we'll chuck a hundred in this. Uh, yeah, there you go. And then we'll chuck another hundred in this one. And then chuck a hundred in this one. Seems like it would make sense. And this is my survival shelter, so if memory serves, I equip that with like everything I would ever need. Right, so, now, I can actually, oh, I... excuse me, you fucking what? What am I in battle with? Hello? Oh, where did you come from? You were never here before. Can you... Can we not with this? Wait, can I... Can I get rid of that? There you go. Alright, now it should just be you, right? You're, you're, you're what I'm in combat with? Yep, yep, there we go. Oh, hi. Um, okay, there's a couple of you. Come, come. That's it, come on. Down, down, down you go. There, there we go. Lovely. And uh, you two, you want to go down? That's it. Down you go. Yeah, I don't really care about your poison shit. I mean, I do, because apparently it hurts a lot. Um, but I mean, overall, more meat, I guess, more food and stuff, and also some biomatter, which I am very happy about having. I mean, I didn't exactly mean. Uh, there we go. Alright, so I actually wanted to loot that. Right, so, they can all go to hell, I am going to let myself heal up a little bit, and um, I'm going to collect some things from around the base, and then we're going to get on a move, because I have a little adventure plan, but it's going to take us some time. Also, I do need to give my uh, new drill ship, the new travel ship, a bit of a maiden voyage. So, in order to do that, I do first need to actually gather some stuff up. Am I, am I ever actually going to be out of battle, Is, or am I just permanently stuck in combat now? Alright, there we go, okay. It's finally decided to release me from combat. Alright, so yeah, I still have so much stuff. Just so much stuff. Um, Is there anything in particular? I mean, I suppose really I should take all of this bollocks with me in case I need it mm, I should probably take this stuff with me as well and also these 
definitely not going to hurt to take those. Or those. And... I'm thinking maybe I should take a couple of those. A little bit of cobalt. A little bit of silver. And a little bit of aluminium. Everything else I can kind of just find nice and easily. It wouldn't be really that difficult for me to find anything that I need. I already know where most of them spawn anyway, so... Uh, anything else? Is there anything else that we would be benefit from taking? Uh, I mean, that, obviously. Um, and, I mean, water's, water's really easy to get hold of, so, you know, I don't think we need that. Definitely, definitely going to take a couple of... Okay, fair enough. I have run out of inventory space. But it's fine, because all of this stuff's actually going to be going in the survival base anyways. So... This is all just stuff that I think I might need, or that would be an idea for me to at least have on me, just in case. Yeah, we've already got a bit of water on there. A uh, little bit extra. Obviously, I always carry um, water on me anyway. Um, I think what we will do is we'll open up that and just shove... All of that, just all of it in there. And we'll shove you in those as well. Again, I'm not really too fussed if this thing gets filled up because... I mean, this thing has a lot of storage. It's got plenty of storage for everything that I might need so I'm gonna go and grab whatever the base has managed to make um, for the uranium rod wise and then I'm gonna go and grab some more of my uranium so we'll grab the extra 32 I'm not actually going to put that 32 into a generator though, I'm actually going to keep that separate. Because we're preparing for a journey after all, you know, we've got to be ready for any possible circumstance, including me just being a derp and not regularly refueling. So uh, I want the ability to make plenty of that should I need to. I mean, it's not like I ain't got enough. Right, lovely. I think that's pretty much us good to go. All I've got to do is pack this away, get in the, um, well, turn the engines on. And then we should be all good. Um, I'm actually going to keep the uranium in a separate, uh chest now that I think about it. I think it'd be good to have the uranium all in a different chest. There we go, and then I will chuck these in there. I've brought the deuterium with me, just on the off chance that I do decide to add a deuterium generator to this. But, I believe that is us ready to go. So, time to power this beast up. Actually, I should make sure that those are all... Yep, they do seem to be functioning. Make sure that my, uh... Yeah, yeah, whatever. Right, so you're unlocked. You're unlocked. Those are all set and ready to go. 
which means that back end is too heavy, isn't it? I don't think that back end can lift itself. Huh. Okay, that's interesting. Or, ah, I wonder. Might that be because it's a different building? Also, that doesn't appear to uh, be working quite the way I intended it to. Huh. I wonder if it's because it's considering that as a different set of weight. Right, so we should be back down on the ground. Right, lovely. That's uh, none of that is what I intended to do. Huh. Right then. That. Is a bit of a predicament. Hmm. Don't know what I'm going to do about that. I don't think there's really any way I can fix that. Because I'm pretty certain if I... Probably not enough resources. Oh yeah, because I took all my basic frames out, didn't I? Duh. Uh, where did I shove those basic frames out? That's the question. Mm, there and there. That should give me enough to actually... Now, are you going to allow me to merge... No, you're not, because you're not actually at an equal footing. Ooh, that's going to be a problem. I can't merge those because they're no longer... Equal, because... This being as heavy as it is, that is freaking out something rotten. Fair enough. Um, exactly am I going to do about this? Oh god. I need something extra to push against that. That's what I need. Which means more landing gear is in need. Time to engineer myself a way out of this somehow. Um... Can we have some of those, please? Also, I am actually thinking maybe I might just make. Actually, you know what? Nah. I think what I might actually do. Right, so the center is actually there. Which means that is in the wrong place! I need things. Lots of things. And the worst bit is, is I'm beginning to heavily run over time again. Because, you know, I always do with this game. Because it just, it, it, that's the way it works. Uh, you. What do you require? Composite parts and VSC components. Can I get in this door, please? Thank you. Uh, 
Messi and What I need to do is I need to lift this back end up a bit. And because apparently they are considered separate buildings, or rather separate entities, even though they're joined, so their hover blade or their air blades don't work the same. Whoa! Okay. Never mind, apparently they actually do operate at the same rate. Wait, are you telling me that that, these fucking humongous blades cannot lift that building? Is that what you're seriously telling me? That can't be right, surely. Oh no, okay, they can lift the building, just it, oh my, okay, yeah. Oh boy, oh boy, that's, yeah, I see why that is a problem. The back end is just enormously heavy. Um, okay, well, I mean, I was going to do this anyway. So I guess we'll do it now, may as well. May as well while I've got the opportunity to do so. Oh, thanks game. Nice of you to uh, finally release me from combat that I was not in, because you know I was not being an active participant in this. <sighs> and then I need probably what? Actually, no, I think, yeah, we'll do something a bit like that. It doesn't seem like it'd be that bad. And one more, and then that at the end, lovely. And then I can, Just take all of this off the back, because for a start, that's going to be adding more weight to it. So we're actually trimming a bit of weight off it here. And not only that, but it's also going to make this back end a lot, lot more stable. Thank you. There we go. Make sure that's all um, good to go and not going to fall apart me. I swear, I should be. A, I should really be more conscious about the time on this. Um, you know, I'm going to leave that front bit like it is because I think it should be fine like that. Right, so if we just set it back down again. There we go. Lovely jubbly. There we go. So that should, in theory, stop it being quite so problematic. At least for now. But what I do need to do is work out what I am going to do about the fact that this back end apparently weighs a goddamn ton and needs even more air blades than it already has. So, um, hmm, that's going to be interesting. Also, I think I might keep that seat up there just as a thing in case it's needed. Hmm. 
I honestly don't really know what I'm going to do about that. I mean, I guess I'm just going to have to build, like, some sort of light frame to come off the back end and, uh, somehow attach something to that. Honestly, don't really know what else to do other than that. Build some sort of light framework and maybe get some more air blades out the back end. That's pretty much all I can do, really. I mean, they are the right way, aren't they? Yeah, I have put them up the right way. I mean, oh, I think it matters. So I think they all are correct anyway, so... But alas! That is all... Mm -hmm. That is all stuff for another time, because I have horribly run myself for every time. Again, like 40 odd minutes. I do this every time in this game. It's a nightmare. It's because I love it so much, and because challenges, problem solving and stuff. But well, that's it for this video. So, thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button and stay awesome as always. And I will see you all in the next video.